today with another LA Colors haul. I was actually watching, I'm going to give a, a shout out to Farrell's Muse. She had a rather large LA Colors haul that she was doing and I saw the eyeshadow palette in bold eye that she had from LA Colors and I really wanted it and I said, well, the Dollar Tree that I normally go to, they don't carry that particular eyeshadow palette. And so I went to another location so I could actually find that particular eyeshadow palette and they actually had it. So let me show you what it looks like. And I actually kept the packaging because I really, really like the package. I wanted you to see what it actually comes in. Let me turn it the right way. That will be a start. And there it is. I thought, how neat is that? LA Colors with their packaging. So I'm going to take it out of the pack now that I've showed you what it looks like. And here are those amazing colors. It's called Bold. LA Color Bold. Looks like it has flakes of gold in it. So let me open it up a little bit. I want to let you really see how that looks. People. There you go. There it is. All right. And while I was there, I didn't get the one because I already have palettes that I really need to use that I've gotten, and those were a little different. And I really like the orange and the browns in there, so that's why I picked that particular one. But they had other colors as well. And like I said, Pharaoh's Muse, she has a large LA haul. So if you look up her subscriber name, Pharaoh's Muse, and I will put her name somewhere within the video so that you can see who it is. And go and look at her haul. It's amazing. The next thing I got was the NYC Cheek Glow. I actually need to needed to get me some more blush. I like to have more than one. So now I have about four. And um, this one looked like it might do well on my cheeks. It's called a Cheek Glow Powder Blush. So let me open it up so that you can see what it looks like. It's got the cute little NYC embedded inside the blush. Oh, how neat. Let me see if I can get a good view of that for you. Oh, isn't that nice? You know, I can't do the color as much justice, but that is really nice. And it's like an orange tone blush, sort of like a bronzer would be. Yeah, with a little bit more pink to it. The next thing I got, of course, I got me another palette. I love neutrals. They really work well. So I'm getting a lot of those lately, but here it is. And it's called Cafe Ole. Okay. There it is. Let me bring it up a little closer. And let me open it up just so you can get a glance. and bring it up so that you can kind of get an idea. There we go. That's a little better. Alright. And those really are neutrals. Actually the two browns here at the bottom, they're a little bit darker and brighter than what they're looking like in this picture. Alright. The next thing I got me, I needed some more auto eyeliners. And um, I actually usually get it in the NK, but I thought, why not try LA Colors? I've got, I mean, I've got their other products. Certainly, I can't go wrong with getting their, um, you know, their eyeliner, okay? And this is in black, of course, okay? And I actually got three of them because I, I use those and they go out rather quickly. The next thing I got is some nail polish. Um, it's about time for me to do my nails again, but I have lots of nail polish. That is another one of my fetishes. I really like nail color. So here's something. This is LA Colors, and of course, my favorite color to get, and it's my favorite color, and actually, <laughs> eyeshadows as well is black. I fought hard because LA Colors has a mineral eyeshadow, and I started to get a couple of those. They had a purple color that was really popping and brilliant in the mineral eyeshadow. They also had a black there, and they had white. 
and I started to get some of those but I have white in some of my palettes already and I don't really use that color a lot so it wasn't necessary for me to spend a dollar on that um, I also saw of course the purple was pretty nice I started to get that but I didn't and of course the black they had that black and I just love black uh, eyeshadow because it's such a bold color as well so that is my LA black and I know you can't really see the words on there but it's there all right the next one I got of course this is the cutest almost like the color on my lips <laughs> the color on my lips actually is a uh, cover girls divine and I love it it's a purplish like pink color and this is um, some nail polish by Donna Michelle which is not LA colors but it was sitting there along with them and the color just was so nice that I could not have had to be mixed in with my little haul so it doesn't hurt so this is it nice pink color a little purpley it's really 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 pur has more purple in it but it's just a mixture and I think it's such a nice color and something that I've never had before I can say I probably had purple and pink mixes in there but I've got black but this was something new because it's like a nude color and I figured if I use some of my glitter like I told you glitter makes everything better uh, I use it on my nail polish just like I do you know have right now little flakes in there I like this color as well love this uh, particular uh, pale color on my nails of pink and this right here it happens to be uh, by LA colors as well it's the color craze just like the black you can see the words on this one and this color is almost like a nude it almost reminds you of your foundation except for it's a liquid in a bottle that's meant for your nails <laughs> so um, this color let's see if I actually I hate that I, I don't have the name of the color on here do I oh geez that's really not good is it oh wait a minute it's on the very bottom and just excuse me while I put this light on because somehow I need to be able to see it's called um it's a lot batch it just has a number on it it's BCC 659 this really doesn't do justice because it really should have it really should have a number on it but let me put it back up there I wish you could see this I mean if you went you probably would find it yourself but it's like a tan it almost reminds you of tan foundation in a bottle or beige foundation except for its nail polish all right people love it that is so nice and the next thing I got that was different is I wanted to get me some lotions I was walking down each aisle just seeing what was in the dollar store because they're like a treasure so I got me three of these bottles um, they're actually called April bath and shower you can't go wrong for a dollar this one was sea cotton sea cotton and it smells so good this one oh it smells so good it has like a, like a real perfumey smell I like that I happen to wash my hands a whole lot so being able to grab a bottle and just lotion your hands up when you finish washing your hands is lovely and also it's nice to put on some good smelling lotion on your body in the mornings the next one I got oh this one really smells like creamy apple this is April bath and shower of course and it's creamy apple scented oh I lo and the packaging is nice on this I love the apples on the front and the colors makes it stand out and it really does smell like apples okay the next scent I got was verbena mint and um, let's see if it really smells like mint it has a mint uh, a minty smell uh, sort of like a pretty perfume minty type smell that I, it smells nice I started to get some lip gloss I saw that had a mint smell as well but this is their verbena mint I like the packaging on that as well and that is the end of my LA colors haul and I will have a picture of mostly everything in the back and also as well so that you can see these colors a little better um, on the like the cheek glow and on the LA palette I want to be able to um, just take a picture to let you see exactly what it looks like okay and I might do a swatch 
all right okay as always i want to thank you guys for watching and i really appreciate your time i honestly do